to spend 24 hours in the splits and I feel like this is going to be a very hard challenge. I have done 24 hours in contortion before but with that challenge I was able to change flexibility poses whenever I wanted so that definitely made it a lot easier to get around so for this challenge I'm definitely not going to be leaving my house today. As you just saw I started last night so I already have around nine or so of the 24 hours done but since I feel like this is going to be a very difficult challenge I need some kind of motivation to make it through the 24 hours. So I asked you guys on my community tab what my consequence should be if I don't make it through and it looks like the majority of you said that I have to brush my teeth with hot sauce. That sounds absolutely disgusting so I'm really going to try to finish this challenge and as you can probably tell it is the morning now and I'm getting pretty hungry for breakfast so I'm going to attempt to somehow get out of bed and make my way over to the kitchen while in the splits. <laughs> Probably not the best to be making breakfast on the floor, but it's what I have to do to stay in the splits. So I'm going to be making a smoothie bowl. And this one I've made before, it's like a white chocolate flavored smoothie bowl and it's so good. So let's just go ahead and make it. I really just eyeball everything. So I start off by putting some almond milk. Then I put in some of Alani News chocolate plant protein. And this is what gives it kind of like a chocolatey sweet taste. Then I put in some peanut butter to make it creamy. Like I said, I really just eyeball everything. But if you're making this and want more exact measurements, it's probably around two tablespoons or so of peanut butter. Then I add in a frozen banana. And the last thing I do is add in a bunch of ice because I like my smoothie bowls to be really thick and cold. a lot harder than I expected but anyways I didn't really feel like leaving in that bun I slept in all day so I just put a few curls in my hair and then the mail came and I'm really excited because I got two packages since I do a lot of social media stuff sometimes brands will just send me random packages when I'm not even expecting them so the top one is from Alani New and I'm pretty sure I know what's in that one but the bottom one is like a complete mystery because I can't even tell who it's from so since I'm really curious I'm going to open that one first I am very excited about this. So the package is from Verst, which is a skincare brand that I absolutely love. So let's see what they sent. What they sent is the Backup Plan Acne Control Body Mist with tea tree oil and witch hazel. So Verst, if you're watching this, thank you so much. And now for the package from Alani New. Alani New sent me their Fit Snacks gummy bears and I haven't tried these yet, so let's go ahead and give them a taste test. So basically these are like a healthier version of gummy bears, so let's see what they taste like. 
I wasn't really sure what to expect with these, but they are so good. If you're looking for a healthier alternative to candy, I definitely recommend these because they taste like the real thing. So I'm just going to finish the rest of these and it's actually pretty nice out today. So then I think I'm going to go out by the pool. And we recently just set up this pergola on our deck and I've been loving it. So I'll show you guys what that looks like when we get out there. So I'm currently under that new pergola I was just talking about. And recently I've been spending a lot of time out here because since I do a lot of editing, I like how this gives a little bit of shade so I can edit outside during the summer. Anyways, I wasn't really sure what I was going to do while I'm stuck in the splits all day So I asked in my community tab and I saw a couple of you said that I should react to fan edits But before I do that, I'd really appreciate it if you could give this video a thumbs up Subscribe if you haven't already and also comment down below whether or not you can do the splits Okay, so this first edit is by babyx.mcnelty on Instagram and her name is Dana I don't know how she did this, but she put this cool filter and outline thing on my picture So thank you so much to Dana. I love this edit. I know the fan pages put so much time into their edits so I really appreciate them and I try to watch as many as I can. This one is by Sweet.McNulty and her name is Polly and it looks like it's also a collab with Sweetie underscore McNulty. I love the filter she put on this one. It's really different from a lot of the other edits I've seen. It is getting extremely hot out here so I think I'm just going to watch one more edit and then I might go in the pool to cool down a bit. The last fan page edit I'm going to watch is by Fabi and her username is Angelic.McNulty. I love the intro with the glitches and my YouTube video showing and the rest of this edit is so creative they packed so many different effects in here so thank you so much Fabi and thank you to all the fan pages really for all the time you put into your edits okay let's see if I can potentially get on top of a floaty so I can go in the pool while staying in the splits like I said I'm not going to try to get changed in the splits today but I'm wearing a sports bra under my shirt so I think I'll just wear that as like a bathing suit so I don't get my shirt all wet I'm not sure how I'm gonna get this floaty so I can get in the water but let's try to make this work I better not fall in here because I really don't want to brush my teeth with hot sauce. I'm so hot. Oh, I need to get in the pool. This is hard. Okay, I'm getting there. I'm almost in. I made it in and I'm still in the splits. I don't want to get my hair wet because I just curled it. This is a smaller floaty than I'm on right now. So I think I'm going to switch over onto this one because I'm barely getting wet on this floaty. Happen. I do not want to brush my teeth with hot sauce. That is going to be horrible. I cannot believe that I just fell off that floaty. I thought I was for sure just going to go over so smoothly. <laughs> At least I'm cooled down now, but I've also just ruined my hair that I just curled. I was so close, but I guess I couldn't make it through. I really wish I didn't put a consequence on this, but let's just go and do it now so I can get it over with. That really did not go to plan. I was not expecting to need to do the consequence for this challenge, but here we are. I was honestly a little worried when I realized I had to do this brushing my teeth with hot sauce thing because I just got this brand new P11 toothbrush from Fairy Will, who is actually the sponsor of today's video. So the reason I was worried is because I've been loving this toothbrush, so I didn't want to ruin it with the hot sauce. But then I remembered that it came with some replacement heads, so afterwards I'll just change the top of it and it will be good as new. I started using electric toothbrushes, I think around a year or so ago and I love them because I find my teeth get such a better clean compared to a regular toothbrush. What I love about this Fairy Will P11 toothbrush in specific is that it has a two minute brushing timer and three different modes so you can get a really good clean. What I also find super convenient is it stays charged for a really long time so all you need to do is plug it in for two hours and then it will stay charged for an entire 30 days. Not to mention that I love the design with the rose gold and it also comes with this case that is really convenient for travel. So if you want to check out the Fairy Will P11 toothbrush. I'll leave a link in the description. And to be honest, you can probably tell I've been procrastinating doing this hot sauce challenge. So let's just go ahead and get it over with. Okay. I don't know if you can see this, but it's on there. Here we go. While I was brushing my teeth, that was really not bad at all. But now afterwards, my mouth is starting to burn. So I need to go drink some water or something and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.